I can't believe it. going on everybody how are y'all doing we have two huge nintendo switch news items the second news item is a crazy crazy leak but first wait before we get to the news give the video huge thumbs up thumbs up let's crush 150 likes for this video all right it's happened it happened, it happened, and I'm surprised and not surprised at the same time. The Super Mario Brothers movie is now looking at 368 million for its worldwide launch and is expected to be the biggest animated opening movie of all time. Of all, t do you know how many animated films there are? Bigger than Lion King? Bigger than Wally? -E? Biggest opening mo mo animated movie of all time. All right, so here's the uh, details. It's the biggest global opening and three day domestic to date for 2023 outstripping ant-man and was wow it's even talking about like marvel movies and stuff beating them <laughs> all right biggest domestic opening for illumination best uh biggest opening day for uh, illumination ever second biggest opening ever for an animated film in the u.s only after incredibles 2 but that's <laughs> uh u.s but when you talk about globally worldwide this is the biggest opening for an animated film ever because it's it's like the biggest opening in like 11 markets globally it's crazy hey y'all see the hat um i liked it man i liked it it was fun from the beginning too. i'm definitely gonna go watch it again but it was dope 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 and well deserved and good to see you. bro i saw andre in a game explain post this on twitter and he's right nintendo is like at their peak right now when it when you talk about popularity with this movie breath of the um tears of the kingdom right around the corner and the switch 2 is the most dominant console i mean that's there's two the switch the most dominant console right now this is nintendo on top again bro and i'm here for it so it's good to see that the movie breaking all kind of sales let's go now where's my dj Khaled? because we have another one the next news item is big huge pikmin 4 leak i can't show any any of the screenshots but we can talk about the leak bro check out the details that leak from pikmin 4 and this came from a test player and he has screenshots to prove it so this is legit this is this is legit leak check it out if you don't want to be spoiled you have a warning the four captains will be named after dog breeds just like the last mainline pikmin game these captains will have their own naming scheme. This is coming straight from the leaker. However, instead of code words like Alpha, Charlie, Brittany, and Delta, these new captains will be named after dog breeds and the main character, pink haired character, Captain, being named Palm after the Pomeranian dog breed. Names aren't too exciting, I know. However, I know something about the gameplay mechanic of night mode. Right here, you see them in night mode. This was in the trailer. Like, they're at nighttime right now. I plan to share those things later. 
And he's going to share. I'm going to keep reading. He's going to share. Them. He says, oh, also, I was asked if the orange one-eyed Pikmin leak is real. And no, there is another new Pikmin type in the game, but it's not orange. All right. Now, this is what he continues to say. To explain what night mode is, is like I first have to explain what the main game is like. The main game, Daytime and Caves, will be played by Palm, the pink-haired captain. The other three captains will be playable, but only at night. Their gameplay will be more in line with Pikmin 3 Challenge Mode, where you control three captains at once. Remember when you switch between the captains? I was sort of hoping they didn't do that. I like just sticking with one captain. I didn't. That's that was my least favorite favorite part of Pikmin 3, switching between the captains. I want to just stick with one captain, but it's all good. The goal of nighttime mode is to collect <coughs> as many shooting stars, compito, as possible before time runs out, which is around five minutes. And also, it's time-based. I hate playing games where it's time-based too, where you're like pressured to do something within a time period. That's why I didn't like Majora's Mask that much. But... I like Pikmin, so I'm still going to enjoy the game, but uh, not, not, don't know how I feel about these leaks. So there you have it. We got some more gameplay leak um, information from Pikmin 4. The game launches July 21st. Easy day one, Bonnie. Come on, bro. Pikmin. All right. That's it. What do you guys think about everything we talked about? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro. Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out. Deuces. This channel that I'm about to throw out there for you guys reminds me of me back when I had like 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, man. And um, he's probably going to lose shit when I do this. But hey, man, I got to say, my boy OB1, my boy OB1, man, that nigga is my nigga right there. He reminds me exactly of me when I was doing this shit smaller level his channel when i look at it it's such a nostalgia trip and he has a really cool audience too man if you could show this nigga some love too that'd be awesome i don't shout people out unless i like them a lot a lot i'm picky with that but, um anyways my boy obi-1 your boy obi-1 hey man i got you right here my boy get that man a little bit of a look man he reminds me of me when i was smaller you want to take a look in the past my boy this is the way you do it i got you jedi homie. master the right jedi there. master <laughs> we i got you man you're playing two towns i got Obi you man. homie dedicating a workout set to <laughs> you, my boy let's go guys. 28! <laughs> he said he ain't no dead! <laughs>